lot of attention across the state. Students at Wilcox County High School in South Georgia share classrooms and sports fields, but they do not share the same prom. One prom is for white students, and the other is for students of color. As Clinton Bourgeois reports, a group of seniors decided to create their own student-sponsored prom. Stephanie, Mauricia, Quanisha, and Keila say they do everything together, except prom night. We're all friends. That's just kind of not right that we can't go to prom together. In a world full of color, Wilcox County High School still see things as black and white. There's a white prom, and then we have our integrated prom. If any race other than Caucasian tries to attend the white prom, they would probably have the police come out there and escort them off the premises. Yes. That was the case just last year as a biracial student was turned away by police. It's been that way for as long as anyone can remember, and it doesn't stop at prom. Homecoming is also segregated. While still having two separate dances, the school decided to elect only one pair for king and queen for the first time this school year. Quanisha won. I felt like it, it had to be a change because for me to be a black person and for the king to be I felt like, you know, why can't we come together? But nothing changed. Quanisha wasn't invited to the white homecoming. In fact, the pair took separate pictures for the school yearbook. When people around here are set in their ways, they're not too adamant to change. So the girls are taking matters into their own hands. If we don't change it, no one else will. We do it Friday and Saturday. They're organizing a prom for everyone to attend, but everyone is not fond of the idea. Actually, put up here at a prom, we have people... So there doesn't seem to be much motivation to change. We need to stick with the tradition. It's, you know, this is a traditional thing. We don't need to change and stuff like that. I'm like, but why? No one can answer my question. So. And they think that nothing's broken, so I'll fix it. Well, now it's Plain Bourgeois reporting the senior class is raising money to pay for the integrated prom without the help of school officials. It will be held April 27th. The students say the school offered a resolution.